was over 50 of our best slow motion videos that we got from about 100 brake tests in sandstone. And the point of this video is that you can learn so much about how bolts break in just five minutes. Now, we're not focused on numbers and kilonewtons and forces in this video. Basically, they're all high enough. It is um, almost impossible for you to put enough force on with standard climbing gear uh, to break the bolts at the forces we were getting, even in wet sandstone, even though they were fairly weak in comparison to our other ones. However, uh, it's just interesting to know how they break. A lot of people assume that bolts just always come out. And as you can see that sometimes the hangers come off, sometimes the hangers break, sometimes the bolts snap, sometimes the bolts do actually come out. The whole point of bolt busters is to hopefully have less bolts in the world. As we're learning that bolts are super strong enough that if we can put in less bolts that are higher quality, that they are sufficient enough to use fewer. Specifically in highlining where it's pretty common to use four at each anchor when in fact you only need two or three. And it depends on what you put in and how you put them in to minimize impact that is the goal. Now, contrary to what it looks like in the video, we actually leave areas looking pretty nice when we leave them. We angle grind everything off, use glue and dust to cover up all of our stuff. So we do not just destroy areas in order to test this. And we do hope that by doing these tests, we can actually preserve the areas that we do climb and highline at in order to see less bolts and have to replace them more often. Now, our goal at Bolt Busters is to break about a thousand bolts. We're 300 deep into it now, and we're going to actually start incorporating cams and nuts and full anchors and things like that. This is about a $10,000 project, and no, I don't make money on YouTube. It is just a hobby that I love doing. So if you can help donate on PayPal, it does help uh, allow us to do a few more things. I am going to try to get some cams sponsored because that would be expensive to start breaking all of those. Uh, but if you can help, please donate on paypal.com or at Patreon. One dollar per episode does help. So anyways, check out all of our resources. They'll be in the link in the description below. Make sure you like, follow, and subscribe on Instagram, Facebook, and YouTube because we are posting stuff all the time.